I mean, all right? What's up? Uh, what is it? Dude, what's up? <laughs> Could you please just go on the car? Okay. You okay? Just please. Can please just go, please? I'm fucking done if you do. Tori. I'm done. I'm done. Like... I have your back. From now until forever. Okay? Now, it sucks. Okay? It really sucks. But there's no... anywhere in the world that two beats three, all right? This is a democracy here, Adam. I need you to understand that. And your idea is the right one, okay? Going to the cops might be the right thing to do. But it's not what we're going to do. Guys, that's my mom. Oh, oh, hey, Jenna. H hey, Penny. What are you guys up to? We're going to the mall if you want to come. Oh, I totally would. But I just blew my allowance last week. Well, that's too bad. Come on, Penny, my mom's waiting. Coming. Jenna? Jenna's mom. Jenna? Jenna's mom. Tough decision. Come on, dude, let's go. So you're planning to be my hot pepper score. It'll never work. How do you know? Chillbot, show me squirrels. Did you know chili peppers are used in bird feed to get rid of the squirrel? Squirrels chew the seeds and feel the heat. Yuck! But birds can eat them all day without feeling a thing. Strangely compelling, Benny. You know what this means, don't you? When it comes to hot peppers, I am the bird and you are the squirrel. Tweet, tweet, Avery. Tweet! <laughs> Whoa! Tyler, what happened to your eyes? I cut into a hot pepper, then I rubbed my eyes. My eyes don't have taste buds. Why are they burning? What should he do? Well, he's going to have to get to a sink and flush his eyes out with some cool water as soon as he can and make sure that his hands are really well washed and he doesn't do it again. Thank you, Mr. Hot Pepper Expert Person. I'll go do that right away. OK, Tyler, just be careful on your way to the bathroom. <laughs> Ooh. Jasmine? Oh, my gosh, get this. OK, I'm having a get-together with the girls and right when we're about to bake some hors d'oeuvres, the oven broke down. Oh, that's not good. So we checked the crisper, and we put together the best raw veggie food platter ever. Yeah, nice. way to go. Have you ever bitten into a carrot with nothing on it? Yeah. 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 Me neither. Uncooked, unseasoned, this is totally insane. <laughs> I'm thinking you're trying an apple. <laughs> See ya.
I knew it! The loading docks in Musica are straight out of the movie A Zillion Zombies Attack. If we watch the trailer, maybe we can get a Zedge. Edge. I mean Edge. Uh, what do you think? I, um... Uh... Hey, the owner around? Uh, uh, Fitzy will be back in a bit. You can us with wait. You can wait us with... You can wait with us. Or whatevs. Did you just say whatevs? Thanks. I'm uh, Damien, by the way. Hey, zombies attack. I know. Lame. Actually, I loved it. You didn't let me finish. Uh, lame, that movie is not. <laughs> uh, in fact, I'm part of a promotion team for When Zombie Met Sally, the new rom zom com flick. Rom zom com? Romantic zombie com. Sounds coolio. Did you just say coolio? Your movie sounds kind of cheesy. Yeah. How could that happen, right? Teenagers in love, zombie or not, pretty cheesy. Not as cheesy as you. Here's my number. Uh, I was going to tell you to give it to the owner. I want to hang some movie posters in the window, but you can call me too. Geneva. Nice to meet you, Geneva. Yeah. Hey, yeah, I'm Reese. Thanks for asking! Okay, now he's turned you into a zombie. You're missing your brains. No, just my heart. Liam, we had a deal. Tell them they need to let the designated gamer game. Or... You know, you could just be nice and let me have my band back. Never! All right, then! Let's go mano a boyo in a gaming challenge! Yeah, yeah, I beat you and... And you leave Mud Pit! <laughs> and... If I win? Well, then... You... You get my spot in Mud Pit. Deal. No! He was a master, you know, at what he did. Everybody knew somebody who was on that screen. Hi, yes, I have a message for John Hughes. Heard of John Hughes? Yes. He was writing and directing the world that he wanted to see. You haven't heard of a filmmaker named John Hughes, have you? Of course. I did say that John Hughes was the philosopher of adolescence. Do you know him? Personally? Oh, I know him, yeah. No one goes to make a film about teenagers without drawing from John Hughes. All the people I went to school with were like the people in the breakfast club. I just know he lives like over there somewhere. You tried the internet? Don't you forget about me